out here for a quick little afternoon run um, it's pretty hot today it's like in the uh, mid 90s so i'm gonna have to really keep an eye on the temps i got my temp gun with me today but uh, i've got i've got a purple which is uh my uh you know homemade outcast uh, for anybody that's new you know i did i did build this truck from scratch uh it does have it's set up a little bit different of course i got badlands on it i normally i run guitars on it a lot of times too uh the shocks are in on the tower to the uh m most inner uh, hole so she runs more like a buggy uh it's got all the empty all the uh voltage upgrades uh you know pretty much all over the truck m2c chassis and i did put this piece of hard foam up here to uh to uh, protect the uh, body from uh you know just from a uh, downforce or any kind of lid landings or anything but anyway we're gonna run her she's on a 6s uh, 17 tooth pinion uh, the uh, truckified typhon here the truck typhon i ran this uh, uh a few days ago and um i ended up twisting the chassis up pretty bad uh it, it was more of a mock-up build it was i was just excited to get out and run it so i mean you, you know how it is when you, when now you get she's got the m2c on her very beautiful fit right up and also i did go ahead and uh I repair that body where it got cracked i'm um, hopefully it's going to hold up i did shoe goo uh, uh, with the uh, drywall tape and then whenever whenever that with some carbon fiber tape so we'll see if that holds and uh in here i also did put a, a outcast uh, tower to uh help uh help uh, support right, guys, the body. Uh, i'm on 6s 18 tooth pinion so uh we'll give it a rip see how it goes oh Ah, oh, that was rough. <laughs> uh, something don't look right here. Yeah, busted a shock standoff screw. <laughs> Big shout out to Bickety Bam. There you go. Not all landings are perfect. That was a little, I was going for some uh, multi flips there, and that was not a very uh, pleasant landing. <laughs> I'll have to get that fixed up real quick. Oh, looks like I lost a tire. It's one of the 3.8 Badlands. Yep. Looks like she's come unglued on me. Hopefully it's not a rip. Yeah, this looks like the glue job came undone it's not very often these uh, proline tires do that i've never had a, some bad lands come unglued on me like that well i guess uh purple was a short run i don't have any extra of these with me i should have brought some i usually keep some spare tires in my truck but i don't have any uh oh look <laughs> it's an old uh outcast wheelie bar wheel it's a <laughs> fossil it's been sitting out here for months that's crazy it's cool the stuff you find on these bash sites you know but um all right we're gonna uh Run the green machine. Oh.
<laughs> that was rough. guys I'm gonna check the temps real quick <laughs> been running it pretty hard oh yeah we got 188 on the motor about 117 on ESC that's not too bad we're gonna let her cool down just a second killed it Ooh, she keeps cutting out on me. I've been hearing it stutter a little bit. And that motor wires are coming undone. <laughs> oh God. Yep, one came unsoldered. I guess that's gonna be the end, guys. I probably should have checked the temps again. It's probably getting molten lava hot. one 167 168 it's not too bad on the motor but i guess the uh the amp draw this uh, 18 tooth pinion heated up my uh, motor wires and they uh came unsoldered right there so i guess we're gonna call it on that one i guess that's why she was stuttering because it was i was i was breaking connection but anyway it don't look like anything else broke this thing is just a pure tank <laughs> it did well it looks like my uh, body reinforcement held up anyway all right it was a pleasure to get her back out uh, chassis chassis looks straight and took a couple gnarly rolls all right guys until next time rcd81 peace out